The dwarf planet Pluto is one of the most captivating and mysterious celestial bodies within our solar neighborhood. In this article, we are excited to present real images of Pluto while also diving deep into its rich background and significant scientific facts. Despite being reclassified as a dwarf planet, Pluto continues to capture the imagination of astronomers and space enthusiasts alike. Pluto, the former planet for many years, Pluto was considered one of the nine planets in our solar system and was treated as a key component of the planetary family. However, everything changed in 2006 when the scientific community redefined what it means to be a planet. This reclassification led to Pluto being categorized as a dwarf planet rather than a full-fledged planet. Like many other celestial bodies, Pluto derives its name from Roman mythology, specifically the god of the underworld. The New Horizons space probe, launched by NASA, was the first spacecraft to fly close to Pluto, coming within 12,500 kilometers during its mission. Launched on January 19, 2006, New Horizons provided humanity with the first detailed images of Pluto and gathered a wealth of important data, showing Pluto's beauty and its mysterious nature. Discovery and naming of Pluto The discovery of Pluto was a significant milestone in astronomy. On February 18, 1930, astronomers confirmed the existence of this distant world. However, the journey leading to its discovery began many years earlier. Scientists had long suspected the presence of a mysterious celestial body beyond Neptune, but it took around 25 years of research and careful comparison of sky photographs to substantiate this theory. The breakthrough occurred at the Lowell Observatory in Flagstaff, Arizona, where astronomers were finally able to prove Pluto's existence. Since the Lowell Observatory team was responsible for the discovery, they were also granted the honor of naming this new addition to the solar system. Surprisingly, the name, Pluto, was suggested by an 11-year-old schoolgirl from England, Venetia Burney. Her proposal to name the dwarf planet after the Roman god of the underworld was so well received that it was quickly adopted, making her a part of astronomical history. A dwarf planet far from the sun Pluto, with an equatorial diameter of 2,374 kilometers, is considerably smaller than Earth's moon which measures around 3,474 kilometers in diameter. Despite its smaller size, Pluto occupies a special place in the solar system. It resides in the Kuiper Belt, a distant and mysterious region filled with an estimated 70,000 celestial objects. Pluto holds the distinction of being the first and largest known object in this belt. While Earth takes a mere 365 days to complete one orbit around the Sun, Pluto requires an astonishing 248 years to complete a single revolution. Days on Pluto are equally prolonged, with a single day lasting 153 hours, far exceeding Earth's 24-hour cycle. Pluto's vast distance from the Sun, around 6 billion kilometers, contributes to its extreme climate. Temperatures on Pluto's surface never rise above 218 degrees Celsius, and from Pluto's perspective, the sun appears only as a distant, tiny dot in the sky. The hidden celestial body in the firmament due to its incredible distance from the sun, Pluto receives very little sunlight, making it difficult to observe from Earth without the aid of advanced technology. Despite this challenge, Pluto is still the brightest known object in the Kuiper belt. For a long time, scientists theorized that Pluto might have been a moon of Neptune due to its size and distance. However, we now understand that Pluto likely formed alongside the other objects in the Kuiper belt from the debris that remained after the creation of the outer solar system. Surface and moons of Pluto Pluto is a solid celestial body composed primarily of rock and water ice. With a surface area of approximately 17.6 million square kilometers, it is comparable in size to the South American continent. Pluto also has five known moons, the largest of which is Charon. The dwarf planet and its moons remained largely unexplored until NASA's New Horizons mission brought them into focus. The mission provided groundbreaking insights into Pluto's surface and its moons, revealing a complex and dynamic system that was previously unknown. 
NASA's New Horizons mission NASA's New Horizons mission is part of the larger New Frontiers program, an ambitious project designed to explore the farthest reaches of our solar system with unmanned spacecraft. New Horizons was the first spacecraft to closely approach Pluto, and the success of the mission has provided an unprecedented wealth of data about the dwarf planet. The probe's primary objectives included mapping the surface of Pluto, studying its geological features, and analyzing its atmosphere. One of the mission's remarkable curiosities is the timing of its launch. When New Horizons left Earth on January 19, 2006, Pluto was still classified as a full-fledged planet. It wasn't until August of the same year that Pluto was reclassified as a dwarf planet. The first real images of Pluto on April 15, 2015, NASA released the first detailed images of Pluto and its moon Charon. These stunning photographs were just the beginning of a series of images that helped scientists better understand Pluto's surface characteristics. The New Horizons probe mapped Pluto and Charon extensively, revealing crucial details about their climate, atmosphere, and surface composition. The data gathered by the probe was instrumental in shedding light on Pluto's enigmatic atmosphere and geological structure. The enigmatic atmosphere One of the most fascinating discoveries about Pluto is that it does not have a permanent atmosphere. Pluto's atmosphere only forms when it is close enough to the sun for surface ice to melt, creating a thin layer of gas composed mostly of nitrogen. However, as Pluto moves away from the sun, the atmosphere freezes once again, leaving the dwarf planet without a stable gaseous layer. A photograph captured by New Horizons revealed a heart-shaped region on Pluto's surface, which turned out to be a gigantic glacier made mostly of frozen nitrogen. This massive glacier has even influenced Pluto's axis of rotation over time. Mountains and volcanic activity on Pluto The images captured by New Horizons also revealed that Pluto's surface is covered with craters, canyons, and mountains. Some of these mountains reach heights of 3.5 kilometers, comparable to the Rocky Mountains in North America. There is also evidence suggesting that Pluto experienced volcanic activity in the past. However, unlike Earth's volcanoes, which erupt with molten lava, Pluto's volcanoes are believed to have released freezing water, which solidified upon reaching the surface. Findings about Karen Karen, Pluto's largest moon, provided scientists with numerous surprises. Its geological composition is highly unusual, and like Pluto, Charon may have experienced icy volcanic eruptions in the distant past. Additionally, Pluto's smaller moons, Nix and Hydra, astonished researchers with their highly reflective surfaces, suggesting that the water ice on these moons is exceptionally pure. The future of New Horizons Although the New Horizons probe has long since passed Pluto, its mission is far from over. The probe continues to journey toward the outermost regions of the solar system, where it will explore previously uncharted territory. As New Horizons ventures into the unknown, scientists eagerly await new discoveries that could further deepen our understanding of the far reaches of the cosmos. We hope you enjoyed this journey through the mysteries of Pluto. If you have any thoughts, suggestions, or questions about this article, feel free to share them in the comments section. Until next time.